Hey everyone, Tim here from QBKing77.com here to do a video showing you how to manually update to the leaked build LK8 Android 4.1.2 on your Sprint Samsung Galaxy Note 2. Uh, you do need to be completely stuck. I'm going to go to settings, scroll down, go to about device, and you'll see under build number the last three digits say LJC. You need to be completely stuck on that LJC build, which is the latest over-the-air update. This is a leaked update that you can install um, via stock recovery, and it will upgrade you to Android 4.1.2. So now to update it, uh, again, we're not sure if this is going to be an official over-the-air update, so just kind of keep that in mind. Uh, but if you do want to install it, feel free. I'll do a review video going over changes and such. Uh, but to install it, first of all, you're going to want to click on the link in the description of the video. Clicking on the link in the description of the video will take you to this site. Shout out to Sextape for leaking this for us. Uh, what we're going to need to do is just go ahead and scroll down and you'll see Download Update Zip. Click on this link right here. Click on it, download it. Uh, once it downloads, go to your downloads folder. You'll see it called Update right there. Click and drag that update to your Note 2's external SD card. So you need a micro SD card in your device. If you do not have one, you are out of luck. So make sure you transfer this update uh, file onto your external SD card of your Note 2. Once you do, you can go back to your phone. And once you have that zip file transferred over to your device on the external SD card, go ahead and just power off the phone. And once fully powered off, press and hold the volume up, home button, and power button all at the same time. Just keep them held down, press and hold, and let go once this Samsung Galaxy Note 2 screen lights up. And once you let go, it should take us into this stock recovery here. Now let's go ahead and zoom in real quick on this recovery. Now what we're going to do is you'll use the volume up and down keys to navigate and the power button to select. Uh, press volume down twice until it says apply update from external storage. Press the power button and then go ahead and navigate down to where it says update zip, which is what that file was that you downloaded and transferred over to your device and select it. What it's going to do is find that update and then manually install the LK8 uh, update on your Sprint Samsung Galaxy Note 2. does look like it is sitting on this install SD card screen for a little while. Alright, so now it's hit, it uh, says verifying update package. You'll see a progress bar going right there. Uh, it's going to verify the current system. And then I believe it'll automatically reboot once it is done installing. Okay, so it looks like it's finishing up. It says install from SD card complete, rebooting. And then it's going to automatically reboot my Galaxy Note 2. If for any reason it errors and reboots, it actually did take a while, maybe around two minutes to install the update. Uh, so just be a little patient with it. But uh, if it does air out, try and re-download the file and then re-transfer it over to your device. That's the main troubleshooting step if you have any issues whatsoever. So I'm gonna go ahead and let this boot up and I'll be back. All right, so just rebooted, said Android is starting. And now when we uh, pull up the update, we should now be updated. This won't wipe any data, so we can go ahead and go into settings, scroll down and go to about device, and we will now see LK8 as the last three digits on our build number. And also 4.1.2. There you have it. So that's how you update to 4.1.2 Jelly Bean. This is, again, a leaked build. No idea if this is going to be official. I don't know if Sprint's going to push this out as an official update or not, but I will do a quick review video going over changes and such, so check that out. I'll link to it in the description. Be sure to subscribe to me. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. All links will be in the description of the video below. As always, thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up.